Hi, in this video I want to talk about getting Thai permanent residency for those who are interested to work and live in Thailand for long term. I just recently received my PR book a few weeks ago and I want to explain the process, the requirements and duration of the PR application. Before we get into the requirements and process, let's talk about the benefits. Number one, once you have the PR status, you don't need a visa to live or work in Thailand and you don't need to do 90 days report that you have to do every three months and you can apply visa for your family members like your children, your spouse or even your parents. Number two, when you want to buy condominium, you don't have to transfer money from abroad. You can simply buy with the money that you have here in Thailand and without the PR book, you have to transfer money from abroad and the bank will charge you about 3 to 5% for doing that so that saves some money uh, with your PR status but you cannot buy a house with the land with a PR status and a lot of people are confused about this benefit in order to buy a house with the land you need to get Thai citizenship to do that and number three when you hold PR status for five years maintaining your employment status paying taxes to the government then you can apply to become Thai nationality after five years. So these are three significant benefits that you will get with the PR status. Now let's talk about the requirements. There are three criteria uh, to be eligible for the PR application. And number one is you have to work in Thailand at least three consecutive years with a minimum salary of 80,000 Thai baht and pay taxes to the government consecutively. And this is a very important criteria if you are to apply with your employment status. It has to be three consecutive years as well. And the second criteria, if you are not employed, you have to be married to Thai nationality. When you are married to Thai nationality, you've got two choices. One, you can apply to become Thai nationality straight away and it will take about four to five years to get it. And two, you can apply to become permanent resident it will only take one year or two, so you can choose from these two options. Number three, you can invest $500,000 in Thai property or government bonds to be eligible for the PR application. If you meet any of these three criteria, you can apply for the PR status. The time to submit a PR application is between October until December, and you have to submit pretty much every document before the end of December, otherwise they will not accept your application. The documents that you have to submit are many, so it's important that you prepare all the documents 3-4 months in advance. And each document that you have to submit takes time. For example, the criminal records clearance uh, from your local police station, your home country. Not only do you have to get it from your home country, you have to get it certified by your embassy in Thailand. And again, you have to get it certified by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. And it usually takes about 4-6 to six weeks. And there are many other documents that you have to get from your company, like company registration, financial statement, company tax payment receipts, and even the document that shows salaries of every employee in your company. So these documents are not easy to get. So you have to request from your company one, two months in advance because the tax receipts and everything, it has to be original and your directors need to go get it at the revenue departments. So this takes time. In my case, I decided to apply for the PR in November and I only had over a month to prepare all the documents and there's no way that I could make all the documents ready by then. So I used agency service to handle the PR application for me and they are the ones who handle all the requirements and they are the ones who negotiate with the immigration officer on the document submission deadline and they are the one who keeps in touch with the immigration officer and uh, they communicate back and forth between me and the immigration officer to submit all the documents in a way that is proper. So it's helpful to use the agency service, but if you want to apply it on your own, I suggest that you do it in advance. And also there is a quota for each nationality and they accept only 100 applications for each nationality you have to make it before the quota is full once you submit all the documents you have to wait for the interview and it usually takes about three to four months to arrange for the Thai language interview it's not that difficult and 
if you use the agency service, of course, they have very close relationship with the immigration high-ranking officer, so they can tell you in advance what kind of questions would be asked during the interview. If you speak Thai a little bit, you don't have to worry about the questions that they ask. They are just basically testing your ability to speak Thai. And after the interview, then all you have to do is wait until the immigration officer contact you to come collect your PR book. Before COVID-19, the interview usually takes place around March or April. But during COVID-19, they move it from March to April to May to June or even July. And in my case, I did the interview in May. And again, before COVID, the book usually came out in December. And the book finally came out in early February 2022. For me, it took about 14 to 15 months to get the PR book. Once you get this PR book, and then you have to notify your local police station to get the alien book like this. And it usually takes about two to three business day to get it. Once you have this two uh, PR book and the alien book, then you can register your name on Thai house registration. After that, you can apply visa for your family members. So to summarize, one, you have to meet the criteria. And two, you have to prepare all the documents in advance. And if you use the agency service, of course, that makes it a lot easier for you to prepare and postpone the document submission deadline. And after you submitted all the documents, all you have to do is wait for the immigration officer to contact you for the interview. And after the interview, then you have to wait until your end or the following years to, to get your PR book. Once you got the PR book, you have to notify your local police station and request for the alien book. And after that, you register your name on Thai house registration book. So if you have any questions about PR application process, you can put comments below this video and I'll be happy to answer it. So I hope this video is helpful and thank you for watching.